Welcome to this episode of Get Dressed with Merrick. Today we're going to talk about accessorizing with jewelry. Today's blog post is all about that. I will link it below. Um, I broke it down into two categories, two kinds of outfits, dressed up and dressed down, and how to accessorize those with jewelry. Um, jewelry is an easy thing that you can, an easy accessory to add to any outfit. I personally think that accessories complete an outfit in a way that nothing else does. There are plenty of other accessories we could talk about, belts and bags and sunglasses and hair accessories, whatever, but jewelry I think is the most classic and the most easy for everyone to wear um, and immediately helps your outfit feel polished and finished. So we're gonna talk about casual outfits first. I have a very casual outfit on right now. Um, I think a lot of people when they put on a casual outfit, especially as a mom, you don't put jewelry on because you just think you don't need it. Um, I'm going to try to convince you today that you should, and it doesn't need to be extravagant. It doesn't need to be anything crazy, but a little bit of jewelry does go a long way in helping your outfit feel finished and polished. Um, also we've talked a lot about, um, dressing your age. And, um, I think that wearing classic jewelry is a very easy way to take a trendy item, um, or kind of a youthful item and help it feel a little bit more age appropriate. So let's talk about that. Okay, let's talk about casual outfits first. So casual outfits for me are jeans, hoodies, t-shirts, sweatshirts. Um, this sweatshirt is obviously very casual. I've got a little um, striped shirt underneath it. And if I'm wearing no jewelry, it just feels kind of simple. But one little earring, just a small understated gold hoop, just kind of elevates the outfit, makes it feel finished. You could do the same thing with um, a couple of delicate necklaces. I love layering necklaces together. Uh, I would not do it with a hoodie because there's just a lot of fabric going on here. They get lost anyway, but with a crew neck sweatshirt or with a t-shirt, v-neck t-shirt, those are always a good option to pair some, some like simple understated pieces with your casual outfits. Now I have a statement earring here to show you. See how that is very dressy and my outfit is very casual. Those do not go well together. There's nothing else dressy about my outfit that makes these make sense. I'll show you with a different kind of sweatshirt. Obviously a hoodie is going to be much more casual than a crew neck sweatshirt. This one's from uh, Everlane and it is definitely a little bit more dressy. So like would I wear a diamond kind of earring like this? Probably not. Um, this like yeah, I could see myself maybe wearing this, not with like these kind of boots probably, but um, with a nicer ankle boot, yes, I think it would work because this just reads more like a blouse. Um, I have like a pearl hoop like this, which is a similar size to these gold hoops, but um, just like little clustered pearls there. And I think that that's just a little bit more dressy of an option if you didn't want to do just solid gold. Um, but it still keeps it understated. So, I mean, there are, there are options and there's always gonna be like exceptions to the rule, but I just hope that this helps you pay attention to your casual outfits and how to accessorize with them. Here's some other really easy options to accessorize uh, casual outfits. Simple stud earring like this, these are little pearls, or you could skip the studs and just do um, some layered gold necklaces. I think that finishes an outfit really well. You can choose to do one or more, um, but if you do one that's like a little bit more overpowering, like a big statement earring or even just a big earring uh, or a lot of necklaces or a big stack of bracelets, just choose one of those to be the focal point and keep everything else either no jewelry or very small jewelry. So like if I was going to do a bunch of layered necklaces here, I would probably not do an earring or I would do just a very small stud. If I was going to do a big stack of bracelets, I wouldn't do um, necklaces or earrings um, or I just do small earrings. So you want uh, to kind of balance it out so that it's not just like all the jewelry in all parts of your body. <laughs> okay, let's talk about dressy options for a minute. I'm not gonna put this on because I just don't want to right, right now, but um, with a dress like this with a very loud print on it, um, I think that the best option is a metallic statement earring. You want something that's gonna help draw attention up to your face since this is so busy. Um, and it's going to be competing for a lot of attention. And so a statement earring will help draw attention up here, but I like to do it in a gold or a silver or something 
that is not competing with all the color here. This is going to go with everything. I cannot keep that on there. Um, this is not going to compete with any of the colors in here. It's just going to add to it. So gold, silver, metallic, always the best option. Classic and easy. Needs a very good steaming. But this is a good option um, where you could do a, a brighter or bigger statement earring that's not necessarily just metallic where you could add something that's really fun. Um, I would not do a statement necklace with something like this because there is a lot going on at the neckline. There's that ruffle that's not supposed to be standing up, but you know, it is there. There's a lot of um, detailing going on on the chest. And so um, to not compete with that, I would not do a statement necklace. I could do a big stack of bracelets or I could do a fun statement earring like this in a fun color. Um, to help draw attention up here as well to my face. Um, but you don't have to worry about it competing with a big print like the other dress. But the bottom line is no matter what you're wearing, casual or dressy, um, jewelry just brings a little bit of a sparkle and a finishing touch and a level of sophistication to any outfit. If you feel like you're not dressing your age, um, add a little jewelry, try it. Try some classic pieces in a gold or a silver, or a, another metallic. Um, add some rings, add some bracelets, just in small doses, and you'll see that those levels or those outfits just kind of go to the next level. On my blog post today, I linked at the very bottom of the post a bunch of my favorite classic pieces, necklaces, earrings, bracelets that will really go with everything that will last forever. Um, so definitely check those out if